Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Dwarf Fortress. In our, our colony of Soder Book? Soder Brick? I don't remember what it was called. Something like that. We have our, our mighty seven dwarves still. We should get some migrants probably pretty soon. Uh, we're working on our dining room over here. We have a bit of a dormitory. Uh, I think what we want to do this time is maybe get some nest boxes and maybe some bedrooms in. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see how many migrants we get. We do need to get a trade depot going though. Um, first, I have an idea here for what I want to do for my eggs. My, my chickens and I have some ducks. So let's bring this out a little bit further. I have to go out a ways. And we'll do something like this. Make it good. Just loop all the way around. No, not that. And then we can do something like that. And these little, whoops, these little notches are going to be where the nest boxes go uh, for our chickens. We may, we'll need another row of them eventually. I guess we could just put them together. I mean, it looks nicer like this, though. And that's what's important, right? Things looking nice. Actually, we can dig this out too. Uh, one, one, D. There you go. So that way we can have our, our row in here, we'll have a couple doors, we'll have our chickens take, can take control of this. Nest boxes will be in the spots. And uh, then all of our food will be around. We'll maybe put a kitchen eventually right in here. That way our food will be made here and we can carry it out to our dining room, which is over here. Silencer has become an accomplished miner. Nice job, Silencer. Oh, migrants have arrived. That didn't take long. Excellent. Let's see how many... Oh, I gotta change my hotkeys, don't I? We'll make a uh, hotkey... This one, there. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Uh, so how many we got? Oh, we got quite a few. We got we have seven, so now we have six more guys have showed up. Let's see if there's any more showing up here. Sometimes it takes them a while to actually walk in. Here comes one. The, red, the, the gray X's are my migrants walking in. It's like they're all gathering in the meeting room here. Somebody build that table already! It's carrying some broccoli, looks like. Is that everybody? Yeah, 13. Alright, let's get some names in here. Uh, where is my dwarf therapist? Is utilities. Uh, no. Is it already open? There it is. Disconnected. Stop it. Run already. Thank you. All right, so we have, yeah, six new guys. So I have a list of folks that have graciously signed up to uh, die in the, I mean, I mean, do good in the kingdom here. We have Bionicle Beard. Welcome aboard. Bionicle Beard is our, what are you going to do, Bionicle Beard? You're going to be our fishery worker, a fisher dwarf. Excellent, we need a fisher dwarf. Catch some toads and some turtles. Uh, within last week, she felt pleasure seeing a fine table and a, a, a fine seat. Nice. Is quick to form negative views about things. Often feels lustful. Can handle stress. Sees the whole idea of talking, of taking time to master a skill as appalling. Lacks any respect for family. <laughs> Very nice. All right. Next up, we have Holt joining the party. And Holt is our. I hear you see pleasure seeing fine tables and fine seats too. Nice. You're gonna be our farmer. Um, oh, dire beekeeper. Oh, I didn't see. I, I need to take a look and see if there's any beehives out there. I didn't see any. Initially, that would be nice. Values independence, thinks friendship is important, deeply dislikes competition. Can easily fall in love or develop positive feelings. Well, good. That's what we need. We need a happy guy. Dayton. You are now going to be Scout. Scout likes to brawl. Siege engineer, a milker, and a farmer. Completely put off by the idea of friends. <laughs> Prefers a noisy, bustling life to boring days without activity. Doesn't particularly care about craftsmanship, says our crafts dwarf. Fantastic. That is a... Uh, uh, that's what you want to see in a craft store. Alright, we have Zed is not dead. Not yet, anyways. He is a, uh, an observer. What's an observer do? I don't know. Cook and a pressure. A presser. Uh, quick to anger. More likely to throw tantrums and go berserk. Awesome. Has a greedy streak. Somewhat quarrelsome. Sees war as a useful means to an end. Strongly values tranquility and quiet. Values martial prowess. He may be our uh, our head uh, 
military dwarf. Yes, indeed. Who was that? That was um, Scout, I think. No, that was Zed is not dead. Alright, next up we have Jukebox. And Jukebox is going to be our Fisher Dwarf. We have two Fisher Dwarfs? Alright, and a Fish Cleaner, a Fish Dissector. He is full-blown fish. Occasionally over indulgences, hates those who wield power over others. Values leisure time. I like fishing. All right. Has a noticeable lack of perseverance. Alright. And last, but not least, we have Hesha. Hesha is... Do I have any skills? What is your... Um, why, don't, why isn't it showing up? Do you have no noticeable skills? Your crafts dwarf. Uh, very easily falls in love. Tends to be a little tight with resources when working. Could be considered rude. Values decorum, dignity, and proper behavior. Sees competition as a wasteful as wasteful and silly. Sees war as useful means to an end. There we go. Now we have a fighter. Finds merrymaking and partying, partying worthwhile activity. So you like to fight and party. Doesn't particularly care about craftsmanship. Says our crafts dwarf. All right. Welcome aboard, guys. That is what was the name of? I can't remember what's the name. Uh, Sobado Sobadodok. Sobadodok. I can never remember. That peregrine is still out there. We got two dead weasels and a wolverine thanks to uh, Space Voyager slaughtering them. Uh, we will make a few more beds. We got 13 now. We have 8 in here. So let's throw in a few more beds. Uh, back over here. 10, 11, 12... 13. Uh, that's all we have. Excellent. We will get you guys a dorm before too long. Oh, hey, this is done. Uh, this one. This is done. We can now make this into a proper room. This is going to be meeting hall and done. And this one we need to remove. Can I just... Um, just remove it. Does that remove the chair? It might. It's okay. If it does, we can just put the chair back, I guess. What is this? A duckling. Hey, we got a duckling in here. Does it look like a duckling? Oh, it's like a little yellow thing. Oh, we're building your home. We almost have it. Uh, we need to make some nest boxes. So let's talk to the carpenter, which is this one. Where are our nest boxes? Are they not in here? Uh, maybe it's the craft store who makes them. I don't remember who makes them. Out of uh, wood? Nest box. Make me... Uh, no, wait. Just make... Should I set a number? No, just do that. That's fine. And then I'll stop you whenever it's time to stop. One thing I didn't do last time... We still have to get these dang dead things out of here. Good job, cats, but eat them or something. We need to build a farm plot. Uh, we brought all that... Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. Wrong buttons. Wrong buttons. I'm going to have to remove this one. Come on. Okay. Build. Farm plot. We're going to put it in our... Uh, what do we have? It was... Cave... Wheat... Cattails... Something. I don't remember what it was. We have something to go in there that we brought a bunch of. We had plump helmets and we had something else. But I don't remember what it was. There's a nest box done. We got one finished. And yeah, they did take out that table, didn't it? Well, let's put it back. There we go. Our baby chicken is walking around. Alright, you are going... Oh, nearly done. You are going to be pigtails. That's the word I'm looking for. We can use those. We can make alcohol out of them. And we can also um, weave with them. And that's the plan. And we have all these animals. We have chickens in our meeting hall, which is not okay. Uh, not stockpile. Zone. 
I guess we could just set up the individual spots as nest boxes, but nah, that's fine. This will be a, um, not that one, pen. And this is going to be for our gobbler, um, turkeys. And our chickens, ducks, oh, hens, hens or chickens. There we go, and our ducks. We don't have enough. Drake. Do rabbits need to stay in there? I think rabbits need to graze. You guys don't need to graze, right? Yeah, you guys don't need to graze. Okay. I think you're fine in there. I hope so. I'll have to make some doors because we gotta keep doors here, otherwise it's gonna be real smelly. We don't want smelly. We don't need a smelly fort. We're dwarves. It's going to be smelly enough already in here. All right. We need some more chalk doors, please. Door. You know what? Let's just do a workflow thing of this. We should have done that a long time ago, I think. Uh, any material really is fine. Uh, range of... Just keep like one to five around. Five doors is plenty, I think, to keep around. And once they start laying... We can start uh, collecting their eggs. Right now, we are eating their eggs. I may turn that off for a bit. Uh, that way, we can get some hatchlings and get some more in here. I wanted to put a kitchen in here. Let's go ahead and mark off the room for that. Oh, I'm the wrong, wrong buttons. I think you just need that for the kitchen. And then we'll have an entryway there into the food storage. There we go. Now he's hauling turkeys over here. Good job. Who is that? Good job, jukebox. Oh, we need to move our next boxes. Which I shift in. Am I correct? Yeah. I can never remember these buttons. But sometimes I do. No more nest boxes. All right. Oh, stick. As I keep on getting made, we'll we'll throw them in there. Then we'll stop it eventually. And trade depot, trade depot. I keep forgetting about the trade depot. Uh, I want to do kind of what I did with this butcher's shop over here and make like a a, a, a nooch. Uh, I don't know what the word. I keep saying nooch. Nooch is a strange word. Uh, a, a nook for these uh, buildings. Get rid of some of these ramps. Okay. We have Bionicle Beard and Badger are both farming. That should be plenty of food and drink. I think our supplies are going to be fine. We don't have a bookkeeper, so our, our numbers are going to be weird. Actually, we can see it better here. We have a lot of drink. And we have a lot of plants. We don't have any meat or fish. Why aren't we butchering things? Lots of plump helmets. Which is fine. What was the other one we made? I don't remember. Uh, pigtails. You can eat. You eat pigtails, right? Thank you. I think so. Yeah. Um, so the, the, um, the plump helmets, I can't remember any words today. Plump helmets make the dwarven wine, and, yeah, I know they do. Um, and the, the pigtails make ale, dwarven ale, which we only have 10 of at the moment. And we don't have any meat at the moment. We need to be fishing. Are we, uh, we have this spot up here. Are we fishing in it? There's nothing in it. There's just a lot of blood over here from Space Voyager. Did I slate this to be removed yet? No. Remove that building. Is there any better spots to be fishing? What is this? Red panda boar? Uh oh. And there's a dead boar right here. Space Warrior is just, is just slaughtering things. There's all the red, all, there's just blood all over the map. Thanks, Space Voyager. Is it, are you fishing? Nook, what are you doing? 
Nope, you're off running around doing something. Oh, you're hunt Nook is hunting? Oh, Nook is hunting. What is Space Voyager doing then? He's on break. Alright. Okay. Uh, we need to start getting some sort of weapons of some kind. We're making bolts. We... We have a craft store of making the bolts. We can... Um, out of wood. No, we can't make it out of wood. We can make... We need a... No, we don't. We can't do it with this. We need a build. A... We can do a boyer's workshop to make crossbows. That may be what we need to do. For now. I think so. Just to have a few extra bows around. And I think I'm just going to let you go right there. That's fine. Out of chalk, of course. You can make the um, the training ones. This carpenter's one is what makes that. Which we could make some shields. We will need to be trading things before too long. Do we make wooden shields? Is that the thing to make? What do we want to be trading here? We should find something. The mason, what, do you, what can you make here? We could sell rock cabinets. We should, we should sell things out of chalk. I think that's a, kind of appropriate. We can just make statues. Make some statues. Oh, that's not the right one. Um, Alt W. Out of um, any materials, fine. But we know they're gonna be made out of chalk. And keep, you know, five to ten is fine. Keep a bunch of statues around because we're gonna sell those. Actually, maybe even a little more. Now that I say it. No, 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 no. How about 5 to 25? Did I say that right? Did that? Yeah. Scout has become an herbalist. Good. Why are these dead animals still in here? Carry the dang dead animals out. They're not, like, um, forbidden or anything, are they? I guess we can tell you just to dump them. Dump. That. That. And that. Somebody carry those dang things away. What's being made? Boyer's Workshop is built. Who's hunting? Red Panda is fighting Nook. A major artery has been opened by the attack. Um, a wooden bolt strikes the Red Panda in the throat, tearing apart the skin. Nice job, Nook. Uh, oh, it's like Nook was also hunting a weasel. Alright. Uh, do we have more nest boxes? We have three more that we can get into here. Put one there. And then we have one. Whoops. One more. Oh, no, we don't. We have. That's it, I guess. At least our doors are getting made. We got our wall in. Finally got our wall in here. I want to designate. Uh, carve a fortification into this wall. Did I do that already? I don't remember if I. No, it doesn't look like it. Usually you can tell that kind of thing. Because we want uh, we want to be able to stand here and be able to shoot out. And did I ever set up... Let me do a zone here for the dogs. Here, I'll let them carry over just a little bit into here. And this is going to be a pasture for... We don't need all the dogs to be here. Just like... There's one... Not the hunting dog, of course. I have a boy and a girl. Is that all the dogs we have? Yeah, it is. I guess all the dogs will be in here. Otherwise, we'll never get any puppies. Because the way it works is you need boy and girl dog next to each other. <laughs> Hope that's clear. Look, we're carrying them back in here. Why are we carrying them in here? Stop 
carrying rat remains in here. Not only do I have the 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 refuse stockpile, I also have a garbage dump here that I made. I don't know. I don't know. Now there are some eggs here. We need to work mess with this stockpile though. Uh, change the settings. We want food, but we don't want eggs here. A specific egg, actually. I gotta find the eggs that we are making. Pond turtle eggs. Can you raise pond turtles? Hens, ducks, and we don't have geese, so that's fine. Do we have we have turkeys? Turkeys. Okay, so those are not allowed in the stockpile, so they will stay in there. I think they will still eat them though. I could uh, put this like lock these doors and put this off limits. So then they won't run in there and eat them, but I think they'll pick this first. Silencer is now a rusty novice weaponsmith and mechanic. Silencer has just became awesome. What happened to Silencer? Silencer, where are you? Right here. Okay, mining is very nice. Where's my um, roll? That's the number I want. Why is Hesha so terrible at everything? I don't get what's up with Hesha. Oh, he's a child. Oh, he's a child. Of course. That's what's going on there. Chess is a little girl. <laughs> Sorry, Hesha. So, Silencer is a, a fantastic miner. Let's put him at the top so we can see what all his stats are. Furnace Operator 71. So weapon Smith 74. Fantastic. We need to start doing that. In fact, let's dig. Let's dig. Where are we going to dig at? Where do we want to dig down at? Uh, where should be our... We'll just set it over here. And we can set in a thing like that. We'll go ahead and mine it out. Nook is now a rusty novice tanner. A gem cutter. A gem setter. Good. What else we got? Kazak is uh, some things as well. Why is Kazak? Oh, page two. Silencer. Bill is now a novice appraiser. Appraiser, eh? Rusty novice. A rusty novice leader. Appraiser. That's not enough to do what I want you to do, but I will need a bookkeeper eventually. You don't need anything yet? Should I go ahead and let Bill be the bookkeeper? I don't think anyone else... Let me see if anyone else is, is uh, good enough for that job. Someone's there, right right there. Oh, Zombie is going to be our bookkeeper. Alright. That works for me. Sorry, Bill. Zombie gets it. Oh, what's Zombie want? Um, view. You need, a, you need an office. Alright, we need an office for our bookkeeper. Let's do that real quick. Uh, where's it going to be? We're just going to be like our hall of offices. We could build down here, have our row of offices, and, and important people can be over here. And then our rooms and uh, for everyone else can be up top. So let's do a hallway. Uh, we, need the, we need the D button here. Big hallway, and then we'll set in an office, which doesn't have to be too terribly big. Big enough to make him happy. We could put his bedroom in here too. So he can have his office and then his bedroom. How about that? So important folks can be back here. We'll, we'll give one to Bill Nye too. He's going to need an important room. And Bill is the expedition leader, so he's going to need a nice one. In fact, we're going to give him a big one. Something like that. And then... There we go. All right, Bill. There's your room. You better enjoy it, Bill. So we'll mine out. We'll put stairs. We'll, we'll dig down to there. We'll dig down a few levels for now. And this will be Zombie's room. Zombie's bedroom here and Zombie's office. And we'll have Nook's... Uh, not Nook. Uh, Bill Nye's office. If he doesn't really need one at the moment. But we'll give him an office and his, his bedroom here. And let's take a look. Everyone seems to be happy. We're at nine happy folk. Four mostly happy. Let's take a look at a couple thoughts before we end this episode. So let's take a look at Bill and see what he has to say. 
He is embarrassed after sleeping without a proper room. Yeah, sorry, Bill. I'm working on it. Within the last season, he felt pleasure near a fine table. They love those those tables and chairs. Felt pleasure near a fine table. It was blissful dining in a fantastic dining room. It is a fantastic room. It was annoyed when caught in the rain. Well, whose fault is that? Annoyed at the lack of chairs. Felt satisfied. Or yeah, we probably do need to grow that dining room a bit more. Casual worshipper of Kuhn, the confining standard, and a faithful worshipper of Atoll, the decisive prairies. Likes micro line, brass, pink. These are, this is when it starts coming in. Likes crossbows. Whenever we start building him rooms, we need to know what he likes. Uh, oh, well, I need to do one thing. I need to do before we end this. I want to find a bees, uh, a beehive. I hope there's one out here because I've not really messed with bees too much. I think they were broken in the last version. If I, it may not have been. I just may have been not able to do it. What is this? A hamster? There's a hamster out here. So we got meats back on the menu. <laughs> Hamsters. Uh, there's some bolts out here. We need to claim. So beehives look like little uh, bowls. I don't see anything, though. I really wish there would be one, though. Because I want to mess with it. Because you can make meat out of it. And... But I don't see anything at first glance. And you can build a, a, a hive. I'm not sure. What is this? There's a horse. That's my horse. You can build a hive. I, I need to read the wiki more on bee on uh, beekeeping. Because I know that uh, you can build a hive and then you can kind of wait for the bees to, sh to show up. I don't know. If there's not a hive on the map, I don't think I could be very wrong. But I don't think the bees will actually show up. I don't see one. The bolts. Uh, what is bee? I can never remember this one. Reclaim. Reclaim. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? I just saw them. those. Did I get it? Okay. Maybe this will be our fishing pool. We do have some things over here to fish. Let's do that. Um, I could be another fishing and water source. What's wrong with that? Fishing water source. Perfect. We could just set up a stockpile for our plants gathering, but I think it's... I think we're okay. And let's claim... I see a, more, a bunch more arrows out here. Uh, bolts. Out this way. Alright, well, I'm going to put a cut in this video. So thanks again for watching. My, my goal here is... I've, I've always been intimidated by playing... Uh, by doing a, an LP of Dwarf Fortress, because it's, it's not an easy game to... Uh, keep track of what's going on, so this is a bit of a challenge for me of explaining what is hopefully hopefully explaining what is happening for those that are not quite as familiar with the game. So it, if you are not familiar with the game and you're watching this, uh, please let me know if you're able to follow along if I'm doing okay at uh, explaining what is happening. That is uh, that is my challenge for this. So um, please let me know. And uh, if you are lost at certain things then uh, let me know. Put it in the comments, and I will do my best to uh, to uh, explain better. Anyways. Anyways, thanks for watching. I will see you next time.